For the first time, we're getting reports of people here in North Carolina getting reinfected with coronavirus. We have reported cases elsewhere. This means they had it once and are testing positive again months later. Two Ones Knows Ben Briscoe is digging into what this means for you. Health experts say if a lot of people can be reinfected, that means you're not immune forever after getting the virus. The vaccine might have troubles working in the long run, and most importantly, this horror show could drag on much longer. But we're not there yet. Right now, this is still pretty rare and in the early stages of scientific review. Today, Stanley County is reporting two possible reinfection cases, and Mecklenburg County has a little more than 30. I checked with Triad counties, but haven't heard back. However, I did talk with Mecklenburg County's health director. She said it's not a huge concern at the moment. We are continuing to watch that closely. It is not a significant number at this point um, in our community, and we're hoping that it won't be. So here is the timeline of what the state once counted as a possible reinfection. The patient has to test positive, go through all the symptoms, then have a negative test. And then at least three months later, have another positive test. Now, the reason this is considered a possible reinfection is because it's not clear if this second positive test is really just another round of the virus hitting or a resurgence of that first time they got sick. In order to figure that out, scientists have to compare samples from the first and second infections. If they're slightly different, it's a reinfection. But the big problem, researchers rarely have samples stored from the first time around. They're working on changing that and keeping more of the tests that come into the lab, but researchers say this is why it's going to take a while to know how common reinfections really are. We get caught up in thinking that we should have all the answers to the biology of this virus immediately, but we forget we're not even a year into this, you know, maybe nine to 10 months of good research so far. So here's the bottom line. Right now, the CDC says reinfection is rare, and if you get COVID, you're probably good for about three months, but not always. We should know more firm answers in the spring when researchers have a little more time to sort it all out.